Now, how is Agent Blaskowitz? A little beat up, sir, but nothing too serious. They've just finished with him in debriefing. Well, he certainly came through for us this time. Remarkable. Absolutely remarkable. Advanced weapons, biological engineering, robotics, and the occult. It all fits. Into what, exactly? I'm not sure, but it all fits. I was thinking along those same lines, sir. Jack, call a meeting. Yes, sir. Now, what have you got there, Jack? Two Dakota dispatches just in from Ultra. The first one is a complete itinerary for Reichsfuhrer SS Heinrich Himmler, covering the next 48 hours. Now, wait till you see the next one. A private communique from one Wilhelm Strasse, alias Deathhead, to the same Reichsfuhrer SS, dated yesterday. Shall I read it? Please. My dear Reichsfuhrer SS, as you are no doubt already aware, my X labs lie in complete ruin. Operation Uber sold that. My life's work is now a bitter memory. I realize you still have faith in the ultimate success of Operation Resurrection. I wish I could share your confidence, but I feel you have been misled by individuals whose mental competence must be called into question. I leave you now with a word of caution. The Allies have sent a most determined and capable agent to disrupt your ceremony. Do not make the mistake of underestimating him as I did. Yours faithfully, SS Oberfuhrer Wilhelm Strasse. Comments, gentlemen? Sir, may I speak freely? By all means. I have to confess, I'm having a hard time taking this seriously. I mean, are we really supposed to believe that all this has transpired so the Nazis can, well, I don't know, summon the spirit of a thousand-year-old prince? To do what? Win the war for them? Now, wait just a minute. Please, Jack, let me finish. Now, on top of that, we have what amounts to their own top scientists telling them they've all collectively blown a head gasket. What further evidence do we need? Sir, it just occurred to me that we may be looking at this the wrong way. I mean, well, if these blokes are really intent upon squandering precious time and resources on all this uh, mystic mumbo-jumbo, well then... Go on. What I mean to say is, if they're dead set upon sabotaging their own war effort, why should we try to stop them? Jack, I'm sure you have something to add. Yes, sir, I do. Gentlemen, if just two weeks ago someone had mentioned legions of undead, man-made monsters and demons from hell, would any of you have taken them seriously? Of course not, and neither would I. But think of all we've learned since then. Now you're saying we should ignore the rest of it because, why, it's, it's too incredible? I'm not saying I believe it. I'm saying we can't afford to dismiss it. Once again, it's your call, sir. It's settled then. Laskowitz returns to Castle Wolfenstein. Can you open the gate, bitte? I have an important delivery. Sorry, this road is closed. What do you mean, closed? It can't be closed. This is the only road in the Paderborn. I know, that's why it's closed. Due to special conditions of security pertaining to the upcoming ceremony, absolutely no traffic is to be allowed in or out of the vicinity of the village of Paderborn for the next 24 hours, by order of General von Stauff. But this delivery is for General Von Stuff. It's six cases of cheese and sausages for the officer's kitchen. Get him on the phone now. I'm sure he'll make an exception. Sorry, we are completely blacked out. What? Due to special conditions of security pertaining to the upcoming ceremony, absolutely no radio communications will be allowed in or out of the vicinity of the village of Paderborn for the next 24 hours by order... Yeah, yeah, I know, by order of General Von Stuff. Look, I'm not going to be held responsible for this. I absolutely refuse to budge from this spot until you let me through. Suit yourself, but you'll be staying here until tomorrow. 
But what am I supposed to do with all this cheese? I don't know. Look for some crackers? <laughs>
going on down there? Merken! <laughs> <laughs> 